The RIPE database is a public database. Everybody has access to it. So how can you protect your objects? This job is carried out by the maintainer objects. The maintainer works as a lock. You can lock any object with a maintainer to prevent other people from making changes to it. And just like every lock has a corresponding key, each maintainer has its own authentication. When you provide the maintainer's authentication, you can edit or delete your objects. How does the authentication work? The easiest way to authenticate with your maintainer is to link it to your RIPENCC Access account. If you are logged in to your RIPENCC Access account while working with the RIPE database web interface, all updates on objects protected by the corresponding maintainer will be authorized. If you want to know how to create a RIPENCC Access account, please watch the video Get Started in the RIPE database. Let's see how to create a maintainer. Remember, you must already have a person or role object in the RIPE database before you can create a new maintainer. Go to RIPE.net and make sure you are logged in with your RIPE NCC Access account. Select Web Updates. Choose Maintainer from the list of object types. Choose an administrative context to be referenced in the maintainer. Choose the name of the maintainer. There you go. Your new maintainer has been created. As you can see, it's already linked to your RIPENCC Access account. Now, let's protect an object by linking this maintainer to it. First, query the object that you want to change. You must be able to update the object. Add the name of the maintainer to the top field. That's it. If you're logged in with this RIPENCC Access account, then you are automatically authorized to make changes to this object. If you need to replace the old maintainer with a new one, make sure that the new maintainer links to your RIPENCC Access account. Add it to the top field and remove the old maintainer. What if you were to add two different maintainers in this object? Would it make it more secure? No. The only advantage to having two maintainers on the same object is to allow more than one party to edit the object without having to share a password. For more details on how maintainers work, watch the video Hierarchical Authorization.